Alicia Week moving. So last night, basically yesterday, I got the keys. If you want to see the video, I did an empty apartment tour. Last night, uh, my family set up my bed. So I'll show you that. Um, my bed is from Wayfair. It's very pink. I didn't know it was going to be so pink, but I actually really like it. So yeah, they set up my bed. Um, and then my TV and my coffee table. So I don't actually have furniture really to move. It's only boxes. Because my furniture is actually going to be delivered. Um, the furniture that I ordered. So I have an Ikea package coming in at the door. In like five minutes, I'm going to be able to let them in, which is great. And uh, the cable guy is coming in like 30 minutes. So that's why we're leaving. So. Uh. Thank you so much. Okay, so we just got here. And look at all the stuff I got that I ordered. So, anyways, we have to get this in. It smells nice here. Okay. It looks nice. Ooh, attends, je venais t'aider là. Je just wow. This is my bed. Wow. I think I got this from Best Buy. Ooh, atta, oh, atta. Okay, go with me. So, but you got to pop it? No. Eh, uh, never mind. Eh. Uh. Oof, wow. You need help? Yeah. Yeah, bravo, Zach. I move, I want you there. <laughs> okay, so this is the room so far. I don't have bedside tables because I don't really know which ones I want. I got these from Winners. Okay, and then here in my closet, I just want to show you um, like a few things that I got. So, um, again, I ordered, not ordered, I bought everything pretty much from winners in home sense it's just you have to go like really often um when everything was still open my mom and i were there every single week so i got these um sheets and then this is like the softest blanket but it's really like i really like the color so it's from rachel roy roy <laughs> um yeah it's really soft i have one like this for my bed which i don't know if it's gonna match my bed i didn't know my bed was gonna be so pink um but I still love it. And then here, I also bought these from Winners. Um, I just like really love the color and just overall what they look like. Um, they were $19. I believe this is from, yeah, Rachel Zoe. She has really nice stuff. Montla. Wow, thank you so much. Hi guys, so today it's Tuesday, sort of afternoon-ish, so I didn't really film the whole process of moving because it's been a bit like overwhelming, um, so last night was my first night here and I don't know, I feel like I was not fully ready to kind of sleep here, like on Saturday, first of all, it was still in the moving process and then Sunday we moved 
more stuff in then i was not fully ready to sleep here and then on monday yesterday we brought more stuff we brought my cat and i slept here um it was quite i was quite emotional um because obviously i wanted to move but and my cat is fully not used to it she's been crying all night we're still really getting used to it so i cried yesterday like i'm really happy to be here and all but it was quite emotional yesterday so now i don't know today like i'm working at home but i'm like bored <laughs> there's like no sound um my cat is bored you know so anyways we're getting used to it. my my family they're actually coming over anyways that's kind of what's been happening um i took my first shower here this morning i i'm cooking some food right i mean i'm reheating some food but yeah moving is like a lot can you hear my cat it's a lot like i feel like i have so much stuff i guess like we've moved stuff like for four days which i feel like is a lot i don't know how people move in just one day also there's like no way i would have been able I, like i i pretty much didn't do anything like my family they did everything for me so i'm super thankful um so yeah because i i wouldn't have been able to do all of that what are you doing ken are you sad are you sad my little kitty yeah but she she slept with me a little bit in the bed um my bed everything is comfortable i got a new mattress it's a casper mattress i don't know it's like really really soft i don't know yet if i like it um because i didn't really sleep through the night so this morning i woke up my whole body was like hurting but i don't know if it's because i didn't really sleep or if it's the mattress i have this table which i think i'm gonna get another table because it's strangely like really high like it's not a normal height and um it's very wobbly and i don't think it's big enough actually hi guys so today is friday and it's technically it's been a week since i've had the keys to my place um it's kind of messy right now um so i feel like i didn't really update you all that much i'm watching parks and rec right now because i realized that when i'm all by myself i need the tv to be on at all times um and it's all turn it off okay so um yeah it's technically it's been a week i'll sit down maybe here the lighting is not as great also so yeah i just went to walmart and i bought some light bulbs for one of my lights um, but this one, I tried to turn it on and it didn't work, so I'm not sure. Anyways, um, so yeah, technically, so it's been a week since I've uh, kind of had the keys, but I really didn't spend that much time here. Um, so basically, I think, so I slept the night of Monday here. I, we slept one night here and then the next day my parents came over and I just felt lonely all day. I was like waiting for my parents to arrive. Then as because in quebec right now we have a curfew so my parents have to leave my house at like a certain hour when they come so they're on time so they get home on time so as they were getting ready to leave i just started crying i was really really sad so my mom was like just come i don't want to cry now anyways i don't know why like i'm sad i'm not sad so anyways i went back to my parents house i really wanted to stay because I wanted to get used to it. I was like, this is not normal. You know, why am I sad? So anyways, I took my cat and we went right back to my parents' place. And uh, so anyways, we slept there for two nights, which I was only planning on staying there for one night, but then I ended up staying another night. Then yesterday, came back here. Um, my brother put up my dining chair. So I bought these this week actually because I... Um, I had originally ordered some chairs from Structube. They were not gonna come in until next month. So I was like, I cannot wait. So I bought these from the Bay. They were on sale. And the color is like a purple, but you know what? Like I, I really don't mind it. I actually like it. I think it's gonna go well with my decor. My sofa is gonna come in uh, like 10 days. I think when I'll have a sofa, it'll feel a lot more like my home. I had a good night last night. You know, my cat was fine as well. So um, yeah. And then today, you know, I was working, I did some laundry, and then my mom picked me up. We went to Walmart. Anyways, I bought some stuff. My mom just dropped me off. Now I want to make some food. But yeah, as soon as she dropped me off, I was just sad. I don't know. So anyways, basically, it's like my first Friday night. And it's so funny because usually, like, at home, if I had, like, 
the house for myself on a Friday night, I would like love it. I would cook some food, watch some shows. Like I would just, you know, love it when nobody was here. Like when nobody was home, I would like love it because it was like my time. But now that I'm here by myself, I don't like it. <laughs> Anyways, I don't want to cry, but yeah, I find it hard and I didn't think I would find it hard. But even like before moving, we we're just talking and I was like, you know, like I'm totally fine being by myself. I never had an issue being by myself. Sometimes I get sad and like I feel lonely, but it's like I enjoy me time. But now that I'm here, I don't know why. <laughs> I like my little light. It's so cute. I don't do well with change. When in Taurus, so and I also really need everywhere I go. That's why I don't travel. I need to feel at home. So hello Ken. You look so cute. I'm so sorry we're alone, Ken. I'm so sorry. Okay, so I finished my dinner. I just wanted to show you. It's cooking really made me feel better. So I want to show you. Um, so this is what I'm eating. I wish I had some rice, but you know, I'm really trying to be better. <laughs> so yeah, this looks really, really good. And also I'm loving these glasses. And oh yeah, I want to show you this. Some of my like favorite things that I got, honestly, are these. <laughs> Like, I don't know why. I just think they look really pretty. Also, I do need something to organize. Um, I didn't find anything today. But I think these are, like, so cute. I so, yeah, I'm just going to eat this and then watch my TV show. It's not so bad. I feel a lot better now. Um, so, yeah, guys. And happy Saturday. So, I just finished doing my makeup. And today, I feel a lot better. Like, there's sun outside. Um... So I feel great. So my parents are gonna pick me up. We're gonna go to Costco. So anyways, my parents were supposed to be there five minutes ago, but hey. Okay, so I wanna show you my sort of typical winter outfit. Um, so this jacket, like I used to hate winter jackets. So I, ne I mean, I had one, but I would just not really wear it. But this year I wanted to get like a proper winter jacket. So I got this one from Aritzia. So this is the cloud puffer. This is the long, like the full length. And I, so this is not like the, the one most people wear is the super puff, but this one is the cloud. So like the lines go in diagonal like that. And I feel like it just looks a bit more slimming. And I got the full length. It took me a while to like figure out, like I bought it, but then I, I thought I was gonna return it. But turns out like I'm really happy I kept it because it's a great winter jacket. And I don't know what, I like it. I'm gonna say bye to my little kitty. Bye, Ken. You look so cute. Hi, guys. So, I'm back home. My makeup looks like a mess. <laughs> but, um, I just came home. My parents just left. Not gonna cry tonight. I don't feel like crying, so that's good. <laughs> um, so yeah, we went to Costco. I didn't really vlog, but it was nice. I never knew I would enjoy spending my Saturday afternoon at Costco, but I guess I did. Um, it's really, like, the only place you can go. We went to the one in Ottawa because you can buy other stuff. You can buy like non-essentials in Ontario. So um, I found something really, really great that I'm excited to share with you. And we also stopped at Popeye's because I have like really good chicken tenders. So I, I had that. Also, like I love this little lamp. I don't know if I showed you. Anyways, I love this little lamp. Um, but this thing is also from Winners. So yeah, look how cute. Like it just makes the room look so cozy. So um, yeah, but what I got is what I got. So it's not gonna stay here. Um, it's actually gonna go in the den, but so it's gonna be like my closet, but right now there's a bunch of boxes there So yeah, this is it. I thought this would be really good because I don't have like a window in the den um, So I thought this would be really great to film my videos to take some outfit photos I'm not sure if I like the lighting. Maybe if I turn on I think if I turn on the light. Yeah, it's better. So yeah, it's a full length um, I think it's like five foot so it's not the biggest one and it comes with a little uh, like stand I guess but my dad is gonna hang it on the wall so it's a bit higher okay so this morning I just received my sofa it's been two weeks since I have the keys and I finally have a sofa do you like it can it's beautiful huh so I just wanted to show you um this throw blanket is from winners um and it just fits like perfectly it's beautiful i'm obsessed with it i got it from the bay um it's called the odette couch and the color is parchment parchment I, I don't know how you say it in english um online it looks really really dark honestly i'm so glad i saw this sofa in stores 
because I really don't think I would have ordered it online because it just doesn't look good online. Like the picture doesn't do it justice. It's just like the prettiest finish. I don't know how to explain it, but it's just so beautiful. The color is perfect. I didn't want anything too white. I feel like I have a lot of like gold accents and I didn't want my place to look tacky. That was my biggest worry when I was shopping because I love like feathery lamps and I like, you know, my bed is pink. And so I didn't want... I don't know, I feel like I needed something very like muted and modern, but not too girly. And I feel like this is it. You know, it doesn't make my place look too, you know what I mean? So yeah, I feel like this is the perfect sofa. It's quite big. Um, you have different options online. I got the one with the chair, but you also have the option of just having, you know, the two seats or you even two seats. I mean, it's pretty huge. Um, you know like it's it's a big sofa but they also have like an even bigger one so you can really like customize it i guess and they have different colors i don't know what kind of i don't know like how the other colors look in person online it looks like a dark blue like a stone kind of color but this one is just perfect i love it so much so um yeah now i just need my new table that i ordered from costco but uh yeah just wanted to show you like I love it so much. Um, I wanted to give you a bit of an update because I feel like this vlog, so right now as I'm filming, I think it's March 9th or 8th. This is a lot of TH for me to say. So basically, I just wanted to update you because I feel like, um, like recently I've been super upset from Instagram. This winter has been kind of long. So yeah, I wanted to add this little part because I didn't want my video to sound in negative. So I feel like in my last few vlog footage from like early February, I think now. Um, it was the winter. Winter is in Canada really hard, especially where I live. It was hard. Um, and the lockdown has affected me a lot. Now things are starting to open up again. We still have a curfew. The curfew brought me a lot of stress for some reason. Like it was... Anyways, I am not i don't understand why we have a curfew we're like the only ones but yeah basically the second lockdown we've had this fall it started this fall until like now it's still you know we still have a curfew um it it's affected me quite a lot i feel like somebody like took my life away it was really hard and also the winter add the winter on top of that also in the beginning it was really hard because i really miss my family but like i'm so happy in my new home i call it a home but like i know it's an apartment but I still call it my house or my home. <laughs> um, I'm very happy here. Like I, you know, things are starting to, everything is starting to have like a place and stuff. Like I pretty much got all my furniture. So it's really like, it feels like my home. Like I'm super happy. Like my favorite part of the day is when I am done with work and I cook dinner. I watch my show while I cook dinner. I've watched so many shows, by the way. Like I usually am the kind of person that rewatches the same shows, but I watch, ooh, I watch a lot of new shows. Um, right now I'm watching How I Met Your Mother, except the past couple of days, I've fallen into a rabbit hole of, I think her, her name is Layla. I've been watching her for years, but like on and off which is the case with most people i haven't watched youtube videos in months and then i want to get a new bag for my birthday so i started watching reviews on bags and i watched pretty much all of Layla's. all for her name i've watched pretty much all of her luxury hauls there are so many bags i want cannot buy them all <laughs> obviously especially not the ones that she buys um and so anyways i've been watching just like luxury hauls and chanel collection videos for the past few days but i've been watching how much your mother and i really like it don't spoil anything but i really like it um anyway so yeah my favorite thing is like to cook and then sit in front of the tv i rarely eat at my kitchen table i eat in front of the tv and then my cat comes and we would just watch tv like that's my favorite part i love my apartment in the afternoon like this like the sun is so nice right now or i really like it um at night with my little light on like it's just really cozy but because i've been home so much when i do leave the house it's hard i mean i've always had some sort of like social anxiety kind of thing but anyways it's been bad um also my period my pmdd pms whatever it's pretty bad for me it's like i have two good weeks out of the month and then the rest 
it's like pretty bad mentally before my period and then when i get my period the first it lasts for quite a while for me and then i'm just like tired like physically tired um so i feel like i only have like two good weeks or like two and a half good weeks in the month and so that's why if i disappear from instagram that is why like <laughs> i'm having my period i'm not you know so yeah i felt bad that i was always like kind of going away like disappearing and reappearing and so i always felt like i needed to explain and so that's why i sometimes it takes me a while to like start posting again but then i decided i was just gonna post whenever i want if i disappear for like three weeks and don't post anything and then if one week suddenly i just start posting every day it is what it is like <laughs> anyways if i don't post videos i'm totally fine it's just i'm either dealing with my pms or um i'm just working so i work full time and you know i'm trying to go back to the gym as i said the winter is really hard but i'm feeling so happy now that spring is here like i'm feeling in the springtime i always feel like really really good my birthday is also in spring so spring is usually a really good season for me and so yeah but this move has been more emotional than i thought at first but I'm really really happy to be here like I love my place and it's really like my home now like when I go back to my parents I went uh, this weekend I didn't sleep there but like I'm excited to come back home you know like this is my home now. and yeah also like my weight gain I've gained like a lot of weight in a very short amount of time like I gain you know this winter like I've weighed the like I was at my heaviest that I've ever been in my whole life even when I was like 21 and when I started going out like a lot because I was drinking all the time because I was always going out <laughs> and eating pizza after the bar, the club. Um, so I was uh, like at my heaviest at that point. And then I eventually lost the weight and stuff. But like now, like I don't drink anything. Like I don't drink alcohol. Like I don't, I'm not the kind of person that likes to drink at home. Like I only drink if I go out. Um, so like I haven't been drinking at all. And alcohol usually makes me gain a lot of weight. So I know like if I go out in the summer, like I usually gain weight. Um, but it's not like I'm not drinking anything. So uh, yeah, I gained like a whole amount of weight and I just felt tired. You know, it's not that I didn't feel good about the way my body looked because I've learned to kind of dress my body and appreciate my body and stuff. And I'm really loving the clothes that I'm wearing right now. So um it's not that I felt bad about my body, it's just I knew that I had gained weight. It was especially my face. And I still have the weight on right now. <laughs> it's only been like two weeks and I'm trying to be really careful just not to snack so much because I, I would snack a lot. But anyways, I've been talking for so long, but I just wanted to give you like an update how I'm feeling and not that nobody cares, but <laughs> just how I've been adjusting to the move. So yeah, so I'll show you quickly what my place looks like right now. Okay, so these flowers gotta go. I know I'm fully aware. I just like to look at them. So, uh, so this is my room. This is it. My little kitty is sleeping. Uh, so yeah, I'll show you this. You know, quickly. I'll leave these tables. Uh, bed is Wayfair. Winners Wayfair, which I'm so disappointed because they are knuckle. These are copper. But you know, I'm like okay with it. And then on my Insta story, I showed you this. I actually just got this like two days ago this weekend. It's from Winners. It's so beautiful. Um, I think I showed you my couch. I don't know. I don't. I'm not sure like what I showed. So yeah, I'm not gonna show you too much because it's kind of hard to keep up with the cleaning. Um, not the cleaning, but the the things that I own. <laughs> Um, cause during the day, like I work and stuff and then I, you know, I always clean my kitchen before I go to bed. Like I never go to bed with a dirty kitchen. You know, when I cook, I clean, but it's like the rest, you know, my laundry piles up, my clean laundry, you know, piles up for a couple of days, stuff like that. But overall, I'm really happy to be here. So, so one of my favorite things, which I'll do a like lingerie and I'm putting like quotation lingerie closet tour kind of soon and show you like my favorite things i went to uh la Vian rose with my mom a few weeks ago they were having a major sale and i got so many cute things like what i'm telling you like cute stuff like cute cute stuff so i'll do like a video and this is where i store all of my underwear and stuff like this is 
like the best it's just it just works so well so these are from ikea i used to store makeup in here okay so anyways i will let you go now um thank you so much for watching this video thank you for being with me on this journey not sure if i want to add anything else but thank you so much for watching i'll leave what i can find some stuff down below for like furniture and stuff and i will do plenty more videos in my new place i'm really happy to be here so yeah the winter was kind of hard but now it's over it's almost over and so i'm just feeling really happy again and so yeah hopefully you had a great winter i don't know i hate winter but uh spring is my favorite so yeah anyways thank you so much as i said for watching and i will see you very soon if you want to follow me on instagram i'm a lot more active on there so thank you for watching and i'll see you very soon in a new video Bye.